Hello everybody and welcome back to Wizard of Legend. In the previous episode, we did this little earth build and it was actually really fun. This, um, this one here, I, do you know, I can't believe I just realized that. I used this grasp for so long by doing that and I've just realized in starting this episode, oh my god. But yes, welcome back to Roguelike Roulette. We're playing Wizard of Legend yet again. Look at that. We can charge it up. It's so much better. <laughs> I'm a special boy. I do not remember anything. Right, let's have a little look-see. Um, this relic triples the critical hit chance for all melee arcana. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Increase Chaos Gym game for all wizards. Multiple graduation relics are not stacked. Okay. Um... Let's have a little look, see what we got going on here. Bouncing Surge, um, generate a series of lightning strikes that shocks foes. Let's go with that and that. And what's this? Enter a calming state where every hit of your basic arcana lowers all cooldowns. Ignite the ground to create a blazing trail of flames. Let's go for that. And let's have a little look about switching about some stuff, shall we? Maybe we can go with some sort of lightning build. We just have the air and the water dash here. We have... No lightning on this either, on our basic. Um, I think the fire basic is definitely my favorite. And for our standard, we have a ton of things we can go with right now. So let's go with a thunder chain and then signature. I still want to go with the hammer of Atlas, to be honest. Let's try this out. It's a very varied build. We've got all of the elements together trying to work alongside. And we're starting off on the lightning floor. So it's actually good that I couldn't make a full lightning build. Because otherwise, this floor would have been hell. But yes, the uh, the hammer, I really like. I really, really like. I thought it was very, very good the first time we used it. I'm slowly but surely getting a bit better at this game. That's really cool. So, uh, um, what's going on? Wait, what? Uh, I don't know what just happened there, but I, I used my Q and nothing happened. I'm not sure exactly why. I think it's because I let go of it too early or something. All right, let's do that. Keep on going through here. Oh my god. Oh, did I forget how to play or something? What is going on with me right now? Don't worry. I'll get back to it. As I've said previously, I'm trying my best to, to leave a bit of time between my videos. Ooh, let's, let's upgrade this when we can, yeah. Um, yeah, I've been trying to leave it a little bit of time between my videos so I can get your guys' feedback and make sure I'm taking on board everything that you're saying. Um, and obviously, that is leading to a few problems because every now and again, I'm... Uh, playing and just absolutely crapping the bed because I'm so bad. Oh my god. I wish I was good at this game. This is just the worst start ever. I apologize what we got here. Um, taking damage increases your maximum health up to a certain limit. Increase overall signature charge gain. Defeating enemy, pushing them into a pit grants a small heal. That sounds really good. I'm actually going to get the heal straight away here. I know I said I was going to get the fire, but I think the heal is super necessary right now. I'm, I'm playing so bad. I very much require it, and it's sad to say that I do, but I do. It's sad to say, but I need it. I just love this fire. It's so good. It's so good. Right, keep on moving on. Keep on keeping on. Make sure we discover everything there is to discover. Did I not get hit by that then? That was, that was impressive. And I actually froze that guy too. I haven't been using that anywhere near as much as I should be. Brrr. I really love the hammer swing. The hammer swing is like my favorite right now. Alright, get him. Finish him off. Got him. And then we should be able to get a hammer going for our next fight. Hey, we do have a care shop. Let's have a look see. I really want to take something that's kind of risky here. Destroy all standard relics in your inventory and increase your damage for each relic destroyed. Whoa. Um, increase the damage and cooldown for your unenhanced arcana, but decreases the damage and cooldown of your enhanced. Well, let's just do that, shall we? Let's just not enhance anything. So none of, not, none of the things we have right now are enhanced. So let's just keep them all as they are. So, basically, the unenhanced versions just have less capabilities. It's not like they have less damage. They just they have less of one of the skills or something. So, I think this could actually work really well for us. Because this, I mean, this hammer's insanely good. I'm loving it. And we've just got a ton more damage out of nowhere, basically. So, I'm very happy with that. Uh, let's have a look-see. 
Um, actually, no, let's not do that. Uh, where do we want to go? Where do we want to go? Map, where you at? So we've got to go up this way, I think. Quit. And keep moving on. Making sure we're constantly exploring new places to go. We are. We are. Okay, we've got our boss here. Actually found everywhere there is to find now, haven't we? Yeah, we have. So let's just go for the boss. Three, two, one, strike. I'm actually really annoyed that I messed it up. <laughs> that was a bad usage of that. Oh, damn. He hit me a lot there. I'm going to try and get this guy normally. There you go. Ow. Just keep pummeling him. It's fine. Ow. You're a bastard. You kept getting me there. My mistake for just keep on pummeling him, but... We got the matchstick. I think that just increases our fire damage, which obviously isn't terrible at all. Um, increased fire damage, 12%. Extra 12% on our basic, basically. Uh, basic, basically. You see what I said? You see what I did there? Oh, ho, ho. On to the next floor. I'm not super confident in this run, to be honest. Not super confident because we're, uh, we're just at quite low health. I kind of messed that boss up quite a lot. Honestly, the bosses really aren't that hard in this game. At least once you know what they do, and I definitely know what that one does. I just got overconfident and decided to wail on him. I really shouldn't have done that. I really shouldn't have done that. I should have just waited my turn, played it normally. Now, I do wish I had the thing that... Aw. Oh, I do wish I had the thing that healed me when I pushed things off the edge there, because that would have been super useful right then. I wonder how much of a small heal it really is. Like, it said small heal. Oh, my God. I did not mean to hear about that. Is it, like, a super small heal? Like, 10? Or is it, like, 25? Because 25 would be great. Nice. Got him. We found our boss already, actually, which is surprising. We don't normally find it that quickly. Excuse me, Portal. I do not want to walk through you again. You have, you have been sorely mistaken as to my intent. Brrr, boom. I love the, how far it knocks them back as well. Are you kidding me? That hit me. What? I'm super upset about that. I just got wailed on by accident. Goddamn. We're making our way there. M m m make my way downtown with my wizard. We're gonna see if we can kill some boys. Brrr. And of course, of course I got hit by that. This may end up being a two-run episode because I'm about to die. I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is gonna be a two-run episode. Do not worry about it. Eight minutes in and we're already dead. That is, that is depressing. Um, so... Let's have a little look, see. We just unlocked this one here. I do wanna I do wanna try and use that. What else have we unlock? Anything else? No. So let's try and use the dark the dark katana, uh, katana. I wonder what class is as a um Ion Spike. Let's go with that. An arrow? Okay. Let's have a little look, see. So, this clan classes a melee, doesn't it? Um, I wish it would tell you what classes melee. I'm guessing that does. Obviously, they won't be melee. Um, wall of Fire. Let's try that out. And then I'm guessing the hammer counts as melee as well, so let's stick with that. So, triple crit rate could be really good. I really don't know what classes is uh, melee, though. I'm guessing the, the fists definitely do, because, I mean, fists are obvious. But the hammer, I'm not sure. Because it's still technically like a spell. Okay, yeah, that crit rate's high. We'll, we'll, we'll be able to, like, see from how this works. That's definitely melee as well. That looks super, super melee. Oh, my God. This is annoying. Yeah, that didn't die. What? thought it died. Yeah, I think I think this water thing's melee as well. I, I, I mainly thought this was melee because it looks like a fist. Okay, that was that was the most sexual thing I've ever seen in my life. Do you see that? It was beautiful. We just pushed all of those off so easily. Ooh. 
Whoa. This is a this is a nice combo. I'm liking this. We got ourselves add a chance to burn foes. Signature stage charge until used. That's kind of nice. Um, increase gold game for all wizards. Um, adds more uses to multi-use arcana. Um, I'm kind of interested in the adds a chance to burn. Maybe we'll come back for that. Not exactly fitting of our build right now, but I like the sound of it. Excuse me, sir. Brrr. Oh, that was kind of a waste. Oh, well. I get hit so much. We've got the Earth Grasp there. We've got an Enhanced. Uh, the Arcana allows you to seize a foe and leap high into the air before crashing down. Eh. Not too interested in any of those, to be honest. I'm liking what we got right now. But, 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 unfortunately we lost our cursed one. I'm hoping we can get another cursed one that'll be pretty good. I'm I'm getting really annoyed by the um, the the fist thing. So sorry, the hammer. Sometimes when you use it, it just does nothing, and I'm not really sure why. Like, so if you just notice there, normally the the water one pummels them like a good number of times and that time it just didn't and i'm really not sure why i i i'm i'm having a real ha uh, hard time figuring out how some of these work and also how do i destroy these barrels exactly so i just gotta let the enemies destroy them i guess what's going on Just kill me. I d I'm, I'm having a really hard time understanding what's happening there. I don't know how many of you out there have played too much Wizard of Legend. I'm sure to go back in with the same build because I enjoyed it. But I feel like sometimes I use my ability and nothing happens. Like, I, I press Q there to use my hammer. Maybe it's when you're up against a wall? No, it's not. I... I really don't know then, because I really felt like I was right up close to that enemy and it would have hit them and it just didn't. Like that. Did I get stunned out of the ability or something? Is that what it is? That kind of makes sense, but it would be nice to have a bigger indicator of that happening. Because it's very difficult to tell when that happens. Or at least I'm finding it very difficult, which is awkward. Excuse me, sirs. Excuse me, sirs. Wow, yeah, I'm, I'm just bad at bad at dodging. That, that's, just, that's just it, isn't it? I'm just really bad at dodging things. This is going to be a three-run episode. Sad times. We were making so much progress, and now... Now we've, we've gone to this. I'm loving this extra crit chance, though. It's very, very nice. Nice bit of healing there. Ooh, excuse me. Okay, these guys are strong. It seems as well that if I dash out, I can dash out of my own ability, which is kind of annoying, but it's fine. Good, good, good. Hmm. Thought I'd find a new area there. Apparently not. Maybe down here? Nope. Okay, over this way then. So all of the shops are over this way, apparently. It's, I find it really hard to stun off these guys. Like, I just don't quite have the range for it. What you got for me? Increased damage, but store price are increased. Um, immediately receive a large sum of gold. All gold gained with interest goes towards paying off this debt. Expand all gold that expend all gold at the start of each floor and heal for the fraction amount. Let's just go for the increased store prices with increased damage. That sounds nice. That's a mimic. Oh my god. Oh. It's annoying that when you get stun locks, you don't get a notification to tell you because I keep trying to use my abilities after I get stun locked out of them and just dying over and over again. And what the hell? Okay. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna admit, I'm gonna admit something here. I'm gonna admit something here. I'm really bad at this game. Unexpected, I know, but I'm really bad at this game. Let's go with increased all water damage. And let's, let's just do a water build. Um, we can't even afford that, god damn it. We don't even have, I even know we didn't have a water basic. We don't even have a water basic. That's sad. I'm gonna go with the air basic, I like that one. Right, let's try this out, shall we? I'm, I'm just, just sad. <laughs> We, we did really well on the, on the last few uh, episodes. I don't know if it's because I'm playing too fast or I'm not playing more cautiously enough. I think, to be honest, the fists are a little too slow for me, maybe. And I'm trying to play too aggressive with them and it's getting me hit a lot more than I should be. Okay, that went a bit better. Still took a lot of damage, though. I think the the air the air basic is definitely my favourable one here. What what are you doing? A collector? What do you do? Allow me to buy your relics. Just drop them on the ground. Okay, nah, I'm fine, thanks. What? Oh my god. Hey. Increased fire damage that I that I'm not using right now, so that's nice. Yeah, that right click is great. Got him. And I got set on fire. Get both in the pit, you. Please give some healing. The chests don't reward you with healing like ever, do they? Healing seems hard to come by. Summon a spray, um, increase all damage dealt. That seems good. We'll go with that, I think. Once we can afford it. Ooh, that's a lot of enemies. Um, let's just do that, shall we? That's so good. That, that right click is the best. Yeah, let's get rid of them. I'm really liking that right click a lot. Excuse me, sir. Boom. You're done now. We've still got one more shop to find, apparently. And there's only a few more enemies left. Must be off this way. Or maybe not. Or maybe not. No, we won't be down this way either. Okay, I'm getting real frustrated with the stun locking shit now. I keep going to use my abilities and they're just not there anymore because I've been stun locked out of it. I don't mind that happening, but why aren't I told that it's happened? What? Why do I? I keep pressing Q to use my ability and it's just not there anymore. I do love the Q icicle though to fling everything off the edge. We could upgrade our basic. I'm gonna go I'm gonna do that actually. I do like the upgraded basic here. And 50 damage straight like that. Oh and another oh my god. This is like the worst episode I've ever done of this game. Oh my god, I'm I'm so bad. I just can't deal with big enemies apparently. Got him. Got a little bit extra dosh, and we can go to 
think it's this shop I want to go to, isn't it? Yeah. <gasps> We're two off the sundering thing. God damn it. Oh, we'll just get some healing. Head down to the next floor. This one's going a little better. I just feel like I'm taking way too much damage in the early game here, though. Like, because, because this game is kind of all around making good builds. And, I mean, it's, of, of course you can enhance that as you go and that sort of stuff. But I'm really not good at that. So if I, if I pick a, a bad build, I just have a bad build for the rest of the, rest of the run. I and mean, I think that's definitely been my major downfall right now. I'm, I'm picking builds that I'm not good with. I need to keep a closer eye on my cooldowns. I'm really bad at managing them right now. I'm just, all I'm doing is just spamming every single one I have and just hoping for the best. And that is not working. <laughs> that is not the way this game is intended to be played. At all. Got him. Ooh, fire. Hello. Boss chamber. Whoa, these guys have got fiery touch. What's all this about? Hmm. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of the uh, of the Q. It's too hard to hit. Like, on certain areas, it's great because it can push enemies off the edge, but sometimes it just doesn't work for me at all. It's great when you get the signature version, though. I feel like I need some practice at this game. Real bad right now. Oh my god, give me an evil dude. Give me the give me the curse guy. I want curses. I need curses. Where am I going next? This way, I think. I think this way, yes. Nope, not this way. Where am I going next, then? I can't figure out where I'm going, guys. Is it all the way up that way? I think it's all the way up that way, isn't it? Got him. Let's go. There you go. Push him off the edge. I can't hit that guy because he's on fire. Just It seems to just, just sp spam them with the basic. That seems to be the way to go right now. Yep, just, just keep spamming the basic. That works. Hey, you get a bit of, good amount of healing there, at least. How did you hit me then, dude? What the hell? And I'm dead again. Oh my god, this is just pathetic at this point. I'm, I'm, I'm taking too much damage right now. Um... Let's try them vines. Uh, yeah, let's try that out. Let's go change this up. So let, let's go with something more generic that's going to help us with a lot of different things. Regen health every time you land a crit. Let's go with that. Let's go with that. And then for these, let's go with... Let's go with the air one again. That's good. The dash. I'm going to go with the wind dash. The standard, I'm going to go with the rippling rupture thingy and the signature. I don't know what to go with all of the signature. Let's go for the Inferno Beam, try that out. The Inferno Beam was quite cool last time. And let's go in yet again and see if we can do a little bit better this time. I do apologize for those of you that are hoping that, I'm, that there's going to be some crazy good... Um, there's going to be some crazy good stuff going on uh, with me playing this game. But unfortunately, I'm just bad at it. <laughs> I'm hoping it's at least still entertaining. But yeah, I'm just bad at it at the minute. So 
Okay, so that seems kind of that seems kind of useful. We can put like tendrils down. And they seem to do a good job of continuously hurting the enemy. We've got to kind of try and walk the enemy into the path, though, which is a bit difficult. But look at that. It's good damage. And that's really good at pushing enemies off. Good to know. Got him. So we've got some health there lying about, actually. Ah, I used my tendrils, but where are they? Like, where did them tendrils go that I used? Seriously. How do you stunlock out of that? Uh, we got this thing, whatever this is. Uh, launch into the air and crash down on enemies to stun them. Sounds kind of useful. Sounds kind of good. There's our boss arena. Got him. Okay, you can do it over gaps as well. It's even better. I just... How did you hit me? I don't get it, boss. I don't get it. Okay, the tendrils are really good right now. I'm really liking those. And this beam thing, this this fire beam may be like my new favorite. Get tendrilled, boy. And you get pushed off. What does the signature look like? Oh, that's really cool. Okay, okay, we're gonna have to use that on the boss. I do not like this movement. <laughs> I'm not good at that. Okay, I'm I'm actually really enjoying this build. This build is a lot, lot more my style. The tendrils are so good because we can just kind of leave them to do their thing. We don't have to babysit it. Um, we don't have to keep looking at it. All right, let's have a look. Close the cooldown to your dash icon as an extra use. Uh, basically, I can have an extra combo. Adds a chance of shock first. Adds a chance of poison first. Uh, let's go with the chance to poison. That sounds good. Yeah, that seems really nice. I like that a lot. We're just killing things so much faster with these fire beams. So much faster. And we got a care shop as well, which could yield something pretty amazing. Uh, increased damage, but lowers the activation speed of all arcana. Um, grants significant boost in armor, lower goal every time you are hit. Increase all damage dealt. Enemies can no longer be knocked back. Hmm. Being, I don't, this is difficult because enemy being knocked back is nice. And I don't know if it correlates to them being stun locked. If it doesn't, that's terrible. Let's try it out, shall we? We've got to try new things. This could be a major mistake, but we've got to try new things. Excuse me? This is already going pretty well. Okay, it doesn't it doesn't affect stun chance, that's nice. Very much liking this build. Right, we have 150 something gold. Let's see if we can buy anything else. Adds a chance to shock. Let's go with both of those. Having a chance to shock and a chance to poison seems pretty decent. Um extra status effects is good. It's gonna help us with things that we're weak against as well, especially if we get to that fire floor. Unlikely we'll get there, but if we do, if we do. But so far, I'm really liking this build. This knockback thing may be problematic. I'm, I'm still yet to see how that's going to affect us. Doesn't seem too bad for right now. It's just, as long as we've got the fire thing ready, that's like super powerful. It's super powerful. I'm loving it. 
And it's healing us too, which is obviously lovely. Oh my god. That's insane. <laughs> the signature version of that is so good. Right, we've got sale. Signature charge stays active until used. Increase maximum HP. Uh, release a burst of lightning when taking damage. Adds a chance to fire off a pair of dragon axe when using basic arcana. We don't really use that basic that much. That one seems relatively useful. Um, I'll probably end up taking that just because... Stupid. Just because being able to keep our signature fully charged when we need it is really, really nice. Because there's a lot of rooms where we get it where we feel like we have to use it because we have it ready. And it's not actually that applicable. I mean, that happens more often than not, actually. Wow, we killed that pinata so fast. What are you going to give us? Okay, we got ourselves the Seekers. The Seekers are actually quite nice. We can use those, definitely. Where's the enemies? Okay, there they are. Whoa, what the fuck? I took so much damage so quickly then. What the heck? Ow! Okay, I guess we're buying some healing then. Yeah, guess we're buying some healing. Because that didn't go to plan. Oh my god! Boy. Boy, oi, oi. beautiful. We're doing so much damage though. We just gotta be careful with certain enemies. It's just the enemies that I don't know like how they function or what to do to prepare for them. That's difficult. Okay, the knockback does have a few issues with it in situations like that. Where enemies are still pushing us and attacking us even when we've um, even when we've managed to run away. We're still getting us. Okay, we got fire seekers instead. Let's um Okay, we got actually we can use birth seekers, that's kinda good. I like that. So let's go and buy healing. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh wait, actually, can I can I just have my seekers with me? Or do they die out? They do die out. Okay, fair enough. Let's go with that. And let's go with that. Where are we going on the map then? Down that way. Let's just go to the blue then in here. And down. Or not. Where haven't we been? That way. So we're going back to that actually. We're going up this way and to the right. Hey all. Boss time. The Seekers are really good. Having all those Seekers available is really nice. That style was beautiful. That was beautiful. Seems like you can make a pretty good build out of signature charges if you got that item, the Surefire Rocket, is it? That means that your signature never depletes, like you can just keep on charging it. That seems like it would be a really good build with the thing we've got now, so you can keep your signature. Because then you get to use your signature just whenever you want. Go on, boys. I can still attack these guys quite easily while they're attacking. With my Seekers, which is nice. In fact, I can just do this. Ow. Ow. Taking too many risks here. That was a lot of damage. Ah, I'm taking a lot of damage too. Oh my god, the pentagram got me. 
Ah, ah. Just stop. Stop bullying. Okay, we got him. <laughs> that was difficult. Okay. Got ourselves this. Whatever this is. Wow. Um, you can now equip this account. What the hell is it? Um, Heroic Blaze. Spiral into the sky. You will flame vortex. Increase the number of hits. Wow. Let's try that out instead of this, maybe. And we've got like a full fire build going on. That sounds cool. Our health is low. We're in a dangerous situation here. As long as we can get enough money and find the shop to heal, we should be okay. Um, but that is somewhat doubtful. Whoa, that's amazing. As I said, somewhat doubtful. That's really cool. We're definitely going to be starting with that soon. Oh, hello, sir. I really like that. And boom! Got him. That is so cool. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Oh my god. Oh, the healing's so nice as well. Oh, the double heal. Wrong guy. Damn it. Ah, no. Stop it. Portal. Stop it. Hey, yo. Damn it. No, he means to do that. Um, automatically enhances basic arcana. Adds a small chance to evade attacks. Um... Adds a chance to burn foes. Yes, please. I don't have enough money yet, but when I do, I'll be coming back for that. Nice. I think I have enough now. Give me that, boy. We've got so many of the different status effect ones. I'm sorry, dude. I don't want to get involved with your shady dealings. This is such a cool wombo combo we've got going on right now. Ow. I'm getting hit a lot, but it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Do not worry about that, sir. <laughs> oh, my God. Quickly, find some enemies so I can cue them. Oh wait, our signature's just fully charged all the time now, isn't it? We can just chill. Don't worry about it. I have just realized though, we kind of have to use our signature to use the ability without a choice. So it's not as good as I thought. It's still, still nice, but it's not as good as I thought. Oh, we got a chest there. Wait, where? <gasps> you sneaky devil. It was hiding from me. You see that? Just trying to sneak away, thinking it could hide just down that corner. Don't think so, Malado. Oopsie. Oopsie. Excuse me, sir. That is the most one burst combo thing I've ever seen in my life. It's just, it's just beautiful. We found all that area. I think we found them all now, haven't we? Let's just go and take the teleporter. Because we can. Because we can, yeah. Um, we could upgrade our dash, but I don't care. I'm going to wait for that to recharge before I enter this fight, because I pressed the wrong button. Wow, I got critted for 30 immediately as this fight started. Not a great start. I'm going to admit it, not a great start. Oh, I'm taking some, some sweet damage. Am I getting a phone call? I can hear, I can hear some buzzing somewhere. No, I died. God damn my phone. <laughs> I was like, phone call? Nope, wasn't even going off. Either way, we had 
a better run towards the end there. We're still finding our footing in this game. I know that this game isn't exactly going to be around for too much longer because I'm I'm not 100% sure, but when we get to voting at the end of the month for Roguelike Roulette, for those of you that don't know and aren't super in, in, uh, involved with Roguelike Roulette, uh, some, sometime soon, we're going to be putting up to a vote for which game is going to be voted off. Um, the next game coming into the rotation, I've decided is going to be Risk of Rain 2, because it's getting a new update soon, and that should be a pretty fun one for us to play. So, in, in like, I don't know, it'll be, what day is it today? It's 14th today, so... Once we get to like the 20th maybe, we'll uh, we'll put up a vote on my Discord and you guys can vote for which game, either Dungreed, Wizard of Legend or Dead Cells will be getting moved out of rotation. And I'm thinking it's probably, uh, this isn't my bias at all, but I'm thinking it's probably going to end up being Wizard of Legend or maybe Dead Cells. But we'll see. And then um, Risk Rain 2 will enter rotation. Either way, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. I hope, you, hope you're enjoying the roguelike roulette and I'll see you guys in the next one.